hi you guys and welcome back to my channel um yo i'm pretty sure you're already gonna like what i'm gonna bring to you today hopefully so what i want to say is i wanted to well as you see from the title that fuck yeah, i always do that but if you see from the title today we're going to be reviewing the jeffree stars blue blood palette so let's go ahead and get into it because i ain't really got that much time so here it is right here came in this beautiful packaging and yes i kept it i have literally had it for over okay when he launched it was march i don't remember and then i got it two weeks after that launch because you know the delay and all the stuff with his warehouse and all that stuff um so now i have it and i literally only played with it once like once i got it and what i did learn from this is that the shades in here are very pigmented and that you have to use a certain type of base with it so i was trying to use the p louise base with this but for whatever reason um the shades in this just wasn't picking up the way i wanted it to so here it is right here this is the packaging i guess um it's shaped like a coffin you've already seen this so many times it's really freaking big compared to his blood sugar one and i do have a blood sugar one uh, recently i do have a video on that just go through it's not that far bag that i did a review on that palette but yeah so anyway here we have here here's a mirror and then here we have all the shades so this is it right here and um it costs 52 dollars pretty freaking expensive but this palette is very heavy very sturdy very efficient the mirror here is very beautiful it's a high def mirror I really want to do this blue look today um, by Taylor Made. Okay, so I really want to do this blue look today by Taylor Made Beauty. Like, do you see that? Like, it is so freaking beautiful. I just really want to do a look like this. It's, I think there's a little bit of purple in it, but I'm gonna try to like use more of the peach tones that are in here. Like, I really want to use this pink that's right here, and I really want to use here, which is Blue Bud, and I want to use um, I'm Cold. So those are going to be my main focus, but I will like probably dip into Blue Monday, which is right here. This was the whole reason I even bought the palette. Blue Monday and here, Flourishing was really the main two reasons why I bought this palette. Because I thought like I would get so many looks with those. And um, they were a little bit disappointing when I used them. So I'm really going to try to like, use a different concealer with this. I'm not going to use a P. Louise base because I really want to see if it was just a base I would use it or not and yeah um i'm gonna come back with one of the eyes done because i really want to do glitter which is what you saw earlier so i'm gonna come out with one of the eyes done and yeah we're just, i'm just showing you how i got that <laughs>
so we're back and I'm done and I threw on some blue hair um this is it here's how the eye this is how the eye came out um I put human nature on my lips and my highlight is king tut so in conclusion of this palette it came out so much better this time and I'm so actually happy with this like I love Blue Monday, literally. That's what I that's what I bought it for and I'm loving Blue Monday. I know that Ocean Ice and a couple of these eyeshadows in here, which is on the back of the palette says well on the back of the packaging says they're not eye safe and it's true. Ocean Ice when I used it on my eye easily irritated my eye and actually felt burning, but so I will be using that on my eye and whatever else color it said to not use because obviously I'm allergic um or you know it's really just not safe for the eye but i totally love this palette um i really know which colors i'm always going to dig into when i open up this palette which is fine for me so that's five shadows um but i will be trying to incorporate the other ones i really want to use celebrity skin which is this brown here and then untouchable and purples like i feel like that would be a very natural um eye look this is celebrity skin see how pale that is it's really pale so um the peaches and whatnot that are in here are just pale especially like crystal flesh that's just a pink um paley brownish sparkly color um so yeah i know i will be picking this up more um especially when i have blue vibes or greenish teal vibes because i do love those colors and especially it would just look so good with like these colors just by itself like entitled by itself will look so pretty and this is flourishing so imagine those two colors together flourishing and entitled i don't really need to pick up a lot of colors when i pick up this palette so that's another good thing i know i can oh like he made a dark teal green too it's called cremated which is right there i mean you probably can't see it but i'm just thinking about like entitled flourishing and cremated like put all together that will be cute too um but yeah i can't really say anything bad i do see myself using this more Ooh, i almost dropped it i do see myself using this more i do see myself getting more looks out of it i absolutely love the look that i came out with today and it blended nice it really did blend nice um so yeah don't use the p louise base with this because it just won't do what you want it to do it almost like changed colors like when i use flourishing with the p louise base it actually changed a whole nother color it wasn't this beautiful till blue it was like darker it was weird um but you know other people probably used it and did some different techniques or whatever but when i used it it changed a whole nother color every color i put on my eye with the p louise base changed another color so yeah um yeah you guys that is it that is all if you like what i bought to you today especially with the new location just go ahead and subscribe to my channel um and also make sure you watch the other videos that i have put on here and make sure you hit that subscribe button